My name's Connor McCubbin. I work part-time slash full-time at the Dumfries Larder. And also on the side, I do freelance graphic design, branding, and kind of visual arts. I'm Jordan, Jordan Chisholm. I'm a creative practitioner and a support worker, but have many interests. Those include bringing people together to sort of like have nice and good experiences. One of the reasons that I struggle so much um, when somebody asks me like what I do is because it's difficult to do what, what we want to do, you know. I went to university and got a degree in contemporary performance practice and I moved back to Dumfries with a hope to be able to sort of like fulfill this sort of creative passion for something that I've got but I sort of realised that it, it didn't exist in just one place and I was very very lucky to be a part of the curatorial team of Blueprint 100 which has now changed to Creative Spaces and on that we were able to do a short research project called The Gap. The Gap sort of explored what there was available for, for young people and emerging artists across the region. Like, what, what can they do? What can you do when you, when you leave school creatively without having to move away? But what we realised is that this was a much bigger question and it wasn't just about young people and it wasn't just about emerging artists. It was actually people of all ages, of, of all parts of their career. And there wasn't just one place for us to figure out what was on our own doorstep, who was on our doorstep, who could help who, what was going on. And I guess that that's where, with massive help from the stove, we brought Connor on board. Like many other creatives, um, I would say that I have definitely experienced having finished college, having studied visual communications, and then you're kind of like out into the big world and you're like, how do you translate what you are passionate about into a paid job? that's going to actually pay, pay my bills, you know. Noah is trying to be a part of that solution. We're trying to create an online resource for creatives from all different practices. We're trying to create a hub, uh, a place where people can see opportunities that reflect what they do, events that reflect their kind of creativity and their passion. And we're trying to create a network of organisations and projects and artists themselves so that they can feel connected. If you are somebody leaving college or even just a person with a passion for something to do with the creative industry, that if you went onto this website you could find something that you relate to that hopefully opens that door into, you know, being able to build skills, gain experience, gain confidence and meet new people and people that you relate to. So that's what we're hoping to do with NOAA. Mm -hmm. NOAA is actually um, something that can aid all the organisations and individuals in Dumfries and Galloway and that it's not something to, to fear, it's not something that we're going to take away from anybody, it's simply everybody being in the same space online um, so that every, people can see what's what's available to them and, yeah. and who and what's around them. That's the big thing. Yeah, totally, because the thing is, in Dumfries and Galloway, there's so much amazing work that goes on within the creative industry here. There, there's so many organisations, there's so many projects that are doing amazing work that are, are bringing about opportunities for you know creatives in the area. Mm. Um, just our idea is to try and have a space where everybody is kind of like represented. And the big hope is that, you know, by the end of the year, that every organisation in Dumfries and Galloway, they're all on that, or at least they all know what it is and why it's there and, and that it's available. And the big thing that I'm actually not sure that if we've even mentioned this is it's absolutely free. Yeah. Like there's, there's no cost to, to it at all. We hope that this uh, can, can be backed by, by everybody.